Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and this is the problem number 69A uh, Problem name is Ian Physicist Okay, the problem language slash problem slash 69 slash A So let's read that problem A guy named Vaisya attended the final grade of a high school One day Vaisya decided to watch a match of his favorite hockey team and as the boy loves hockey very much, even more than physics, he forgets to do the homework. Especially he forgets to complete his physics tasks. Next day, the teacher got very angry at Vasya and decided to teach him a lesson. He gave the lazy student a seemingly easy task. Vasya had to... Sorry. You are only an idle boy in a space and the forces that affect it. The body can be considered as a material point with coordinate 0, 0, 0. Vasya had to answer whether it's an equilibrium or not. Piece of cake, thought Vasya. We need to only check the sum of all the vectors is equal to zero. So Vasya began to solve the problem. But later it turned out that there can be lots and lots of forces and Vasya cannot cope with your help. Without your help, help him. Write a program that determines whether a body is idle or is moving by the given vector of forces. So the input is uh, n, the number of three inte integers the x the y and the z applied to the body print the word yes if the body is an equilibrium and the world no if it is not so it's the problem basically of maths and physics combined where there are three set of forces x y and z axis and you have to check whether the body is an equilibrium or not so what we generally do is to sum all the x coordinates all the y coordinates and all the z coordinate forces and if the resultant force is equal to zero then we say that the body is in equilibrium okay <clears throat> So that's what our problem is all about. So let's quote that problem. Problem number 69A. Okay. So So these n is the number of set of forces acting on the body now we have to define int x y comma so the body is let's say initial in equilibrium now what we have to do is to sum all the coordinates of x, y and z and check for whether that x and y and z equals to zero so let's just take the input x equals to x plus so what I have done here it's not created an array or anything to waste the computer's memory I have just defined an x and y and z that will uh, compute all the sum of the previous vectors of the x coordinate and the y coordinate and the z coordinate so if x plus y plus z is equal to 0 then we have to print yes else no sorry so I think that compiles our solution of the problem. Now yes, so yes, it's a very basic problem of math and physics and basically an implementation problem. Let's just submit it. Okay, running.
फाइव फोर्टीन ट्वेंटी सिक्स थर्टी टू फोर्टी वन बेसिकली दोर्ट फोर्टी सिक्स मेनी नंबर ऑफ टेस्ट केसेस एंड ओ माई गाट एस वी फेल्ड रॉन्ग आंसर ऑन टेस्ट केस एटी वन लेट सी वेल डेट वी फेल्ड ओके सो जीरो वन माइनस थ्री ओके सो माइनस थ्री ओके सो वट वी डिड रॉन्ग हेयर इज दैट वी डू हैव टू चेक वेदर दैट इज़ अ वेरी रॉन्ग कंडीशन एज वेन एक्स इक्वल्स टू माइनस थ्री वाई इक्वल्स टू थ्री एंड जेड इक्वल्स टू जीरो एंड डजेंट मीन द बॉडी इज एन इक्लिब्रियम आई डिड अप्लाइड द फेसबुक सॉरी फिजिक्स फॉर्मूला दैट से इज एक्स वैक्टर प्लस वाई वैक्टर प्लस जेड वैक्टर इक्वल्स टू जीरो सो दैट शुड नॉट बी द केस हेयर ओके सो यू हैव टू गो नॉट बाई योर मेथड ऑफ सॉल्विंग प्रॉब्लम्स इट इज हेयर बाई क्लियरली स्टेटेड दैट अ बॉडी विद मटीरियल पॉइंट्स कल्टिनेट्स ऑफ जीरो 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 इज कंसिडर्ड टू बी निकले हम सो एक्स इक्व टू इक्व टू जीरो एंड एंड वाई वाई इक्व टू जीरो एंड एंड जेड जेड इक्व टू जीरो सो दैट्स वाई वी गॉट अवर प्रॉब्लम रॉन्ग एंड वी हैव टू सबमिट इट अगेन लेट सी वेदर वी पास आर नॉट सो येस यू हैव टू रीड एवरी केयरफुल डिटेल दैट इज मैंशन इन द प्रॉब्लम accepted so yes there will be wrong you do not have to apply your own physics solutions if they are not work in programming so what i did wrong was that i was applying a formula of physics that f equals to x plus y plus z and if f equals to 0 then the body is in equilibrium but as this is not the case in our problem Okay. So that's all about the solution. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.